welcome back for round two of which video game character would beat the hell out of another in a fight. Last time we established that Pikachu would rip the face skin off Lara Croft, Ash Williams would chop Chris Walker's head off with a chainsaw, and Geralt would cut both Mario and Luigi's noses off. So before we get on, we'll just quickly re-establish the rules. All fights take place on Modern Warfare 2 map Rust, and there are no other rules. Love having no rules. Right, you ready? Let's go. Round one, Kirby mm -hmm. versus Arthur Morgan pre-tuberculosis. Okay, um, that's an interesting one. <laughs> we know, of course, Arthur Morgan has a small revolver and a very loyal horse, which yeah. he can take into battle with him. Okay. And Kirby, of course, has the, uh, the godly power of sucking <laughs> and the ability to essentially identity theft. Yeah. It's kind of what he's got going on. Is Kirby bulletproof? Um, I'm not sure. I don't think he bleeds. His power, I mean, he can die. My logic is coming from Smash because he doesn't get hurt, really. <laughs> you can kick him back. He'll scream in pain. Exactly. But he, I don't think it'll pierce him. I think it'll bruise him. You think the bullets would kind of just be like a, it's like a punch, like yeah. a really hard punch. But he can fall off a cliff. Rust is on a pretty flat area. Oh, he's so screwed. Unless they're battling right... <laughs> <laughs> If Kirby was to <laughs> suck in Arthur Morgan and shit him back out oh, and God. have taken his power, and he's, he's wearing a little hat now, a little yeah. cowboy hat. He's got a little revolver. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and Kirby plays by Arthur Morgan's rules. So it's essentially a shootout. So is it like, are they walking paces away from each other? Well, they start at one corner. Yeah. It's a square, it's a square. So you start at one corner and then they're on the, on the diagonal opposite corner. Okay. And then they, who knows what they're going to do? They could go up, they could go around. Who knows? Who's faster on the draw? Kirby or Arthur Morgan? <laughs> Oh, Arthur Morgan, he has his... Dead eye, you're he right. He has his dead yes. eye. He could slow down time and just shoot him through the eyeballs. Exactly. And then skin him. <laughs> and um, wear him. So if we're going by the logic where if you get shot, you're out. Um, because As that... is most real life gunfights. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> They're following a, a set of rules yeah. they've both agreed. It's a cowboy's honour. Exactly. Because at the end of the day, Kirby doesn't really die. But it can't be a fight to the death because Kirby is kind of a god. <laughs> I think you could kill Kirby. I don't think he could kill him with a revolver. I think that's mm. my point. I think this would have to be a kind of a scouts on a kind of match. <laughs> Where Kirby would just have to accept if he lost. And in that case, I think Arthur would win. However... If Kirby sucked in Arthur, though, and took his power, would Kirby not have a dead eye? Oh, shoot, you're right. Mm. Kirby can float. He can fly, can't he, essentially? Mm. How big is Kirby? Um, in, in real life? In real life, he's... Uh... <laughs> Can you Google right now how big Kirby is? Because that changes things. I mean, I'm going to make it, as I'm Googling, I'm going to make an assumption. Yeah. I think he's going to be like six foot. <laughs> I mean, again, we're going based off Smash. Yeah. If Star Fox is maybe 5'8", mm -hmm. Kirby comes up to just above his knee. Really? I thought Kirby was bigger. Well, he's wider. He's a chunky boy. How tall is Kirby? Is Kirby male? Or is it kind of gender neutral? In English, uh -huh. he's male. In Japanese, it's unknown. Oh. Oh, interesting. So Japan don't give a shit. He's eight inches. Christ. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> That's so much worse. Wait, are you sure? It says, it says, it says I mean, I, what do you want from me? I don't know. The guy's um, 20 odd centimetres. Okay. That changes a lot. He's about the size of your hand to your wrist-ish, depending on how big your hands are. If you've got meaty Chris hands, maybe <laughs> not. Okay. Well, based on that, I think Kirby would win because Ooh. Arthur's got a smaller target. I guess he's got to shoot the size of a yeah. well-endowed penis. <laughs> Well, that's my point, because like, that's why I was asking, because if he was like six foot, he's round, so Arthur would have a bigger target, mm. but he's fucking eight inches? But Arthur Morgan can dead-eye a rat from on top of a horse. That's he true. He can shoot birds out of the sky. But then again, if he swallowed the power, then he would have the same and kind Kirby of power. Kirby would, and he has a bigger target. Exactly. Uh, hands down, Kirby. Hands down, Kirby. Kirby just messes Arthur up. Yeah. <laughs> Arthur's Worse dead. Worse than the TB. Arthur's fully dead. Mm. And no one's visiting his grave this time, no. because he got messed up by Kirby and that's embarrassing <laughs> he ain't looking so good <laughs> <laughs> round two Tom Nook from Animal Crossing <laughs> or the goose from Untitled Goose Game Ooh. the goose obviously has very great stealth ability and yeah. the ability to deceive and set up situations where he can capitalise mm. Tom Nook didn't have any weapons so I took some liberties here and I've assumed he has a Glock <laughs> Tom Nook's very good at acu uh, uh, acquiring items. So to me, it seems pretty reasonable he can get a firearm on on his island. I would have assumed like some kind of tool. Okay, call it a machete. <laughs> a 
with like a, a workbench tool, like a hammer or a saw, but a Glock. <laughs> oh no, okay. no, I like hammer. Hammer's a good one. He has a he has a hammer. He's a hand hammer, one handed hammer. <laughs> okay, so not a Glock. <laughs> We'll see. We'll see how the stacks are weighed against him, and then mess with Tom Nook, you get the hook. Ooh. <laughs> mess with the goose, you get the noose. <laughs> <laughs> I'll stop. <laughs> I don't think it matters what Tom Nook has as a weapon, whether it's a Glock or a hammer or a Gatling gun, right? <laughs> because the power of the goose is to steal things. <laughs> So anything he gets his hands on, the goose is just nabbing it out of his hands and taking it away and, and leaving it somewhere. I also imagine that the goose is preparing some kind of trap. I, mm. I can't remember the rust map, but there must be some things lying around. There's some like things you some can hide on the... Yeah. Some... There's, there's some... It's a rusty place. I imagine just there's like some machinery. boxes. It's yeah. like an old oil rig thing. There's oil, exactly. So maybe he can, maybe he'll get like an oil canister, drag that along with him, spill it on the floor. Set him on fire. <laughs> Imagine a little goose. Is Tom looks like, what's going on? Little <laughs> rainbow liquid starts appearing at his feet. He turns around. There's the goose, cigarette in mouth. Quack, quack, motherfucker. Flicks the cigarette. <laughs> Tom Nook goes up in flames. Is that what we're imagining here? Yeah. Yeah, that's exactly it. It's a similar thing to Kirby. Yeah. What is the goose's power level? Um, We don't know. And more importantly... It's untitled. <laughs> <laughs> More importantly to me, what is his motivation? He, he just likes to fuck shit up. Because I don't think he would kill Tom Nook. No, I think he would. I, I think he would torture him. That too. By stealing... Because Tom Nook loves things. So He loves owning things. He loves owning property. He loves owning people. He loves owning stuff and selling it. And this goose is just taking all his stuff. Wait, wait a second. Mess with the goose, you get the noose. He's going to annoy him till he kills himself. Um, do you think Tom Nook is unstable enough to take that? Or do yeah. you think his anger issues would... No, unstable. So... <laughs> Let's say the goose does this, right? He's taking those stuff. And then Tom mm. Nook goes, actually, Mr. Goose, yeah. um, I own this Rust map. Mm -hmm. I own Modern Warfare 2 Rust map 1v1 me. Yeah. Um, you owe me rent. You need to pay the mortgage off. The goose would just steal the rent from him <laughs> and give it back. And steal it again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that would drive Tom Nook insane. Exactly. So uh, ignoring the, the, the mind games. Yeah. Let's say, let's ignore the weaponry. <laughs> let's, it's a hand-to-hand -hand fight or a, a feat. <laughs> A flipper to hand fight. Who wins? In a punch up. The goose. The go <laughs> he just pecks him. Yeah. Have you have you seen geese be angry? Have you seen their teeth? They can take your arm off. They can cut. They're vicious. So the when goose they, is just outright going to fuck up this raccoon. Absolutely. Because raccoons can be quite vicious. Mm, it's a fair point, but Tom Nook is pretty chill. Mm. I think normal raccoon would probably be a goose, but this goose is fucking annoying. It's this, a smart goose. This goose is a smart goose that just likes to annoy people. And I fully think if it was a fight to the death, it would give as much as it could get. I'm with you. I'm with yeah. you. And I'm going to end this round mm -hmm. because I've just come to the realisation that at some point mm -hmm. I'm going to have to edit a picture of Tom Nook in a noose. <laughs> we'll blur it. Nam. <laughs> People need to see what happens when you mess with the goose. <laughs> Untitled Goose Game Goose wins this round. Yeah. Seemingly hands down. All right. <laughs> Next. Round three. Parappa the Rapper. Versus Nemesis. Nemesis has a rocket launcher. Parappa the Rapper has sick beats. <laughs> uh. In a straight... <laughs> okay, question is, are we still going for the fight to the death? It's a fight to the death. Or are it's they doing the rap battle? Well, in a rap battle, Nemesis only really says one or two things. Stars! Stars. And that doesn't rhyme with much either. Fars. Oh, well, yeah, pa Cars. Parappa, Parappa the Rapper's coming in. Mm. He's like... Stop telling me about all them stars. You mess with me, you'll get some scars. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> I get you. I... You were created by Umbrella, but you're not a very nice fella. <laughs> <laughs> and you look like you got Salmonella. Oh, no. <laughs> Jill's a powerful feminist. You don't deserve to be her nemesis. <laughs> yeah. I feel like Parappa the Rapper's dead. Does he have a weapon? Um, his mic? Well, his tendency is to go to places that are in some kind of disrupt or has an issue, and he yeah. raps, and everyone's, everyone gets better, and everyone gets gets along, and gets happy. Could Parappa the Rapper bring Nemesis around? Um, the answer's no. No. <laughs> <laughs> Clear as day. Yeah. Nemesis is going to walk up and stamp on the little fucker. So what's going to happen is that Parappa the Rapper is just going to start singing. 
and I'll start rapping mm-hmm. and start dancing. And he's just going to be doing his nice little tune. And then he's just going to get shot with a bazooka. Or hit with a tentacle. Or hit with a tentacle. Or stamped on. So and his and he's pop dead. Out his head. Yeah. What if we, we change this up <laughs> okay. and we say it's not just Prep the Rapper. It's the whole gang. How many are there in the there's gang? A, there's a, an onion chef man. There's, I think it's a moose Squished. police woman. Squished again. Okay, who else? I, I don't. I, I don't. Is that it? There's no. There are, there's more, but I don't think there's anyone I could say. <laughs> Smushed. <laughs> <laughs> he's making a. He's making a stew out of these guys. I think, especially if you think about how many people you can explode with one bazooka rocket. Um, I think they're dead. I put this to you then, Jill Valentine. Yeah. Very skinny young lady. Mm-hmm. Um, Has guns. Okay, give Prapper the rapper a Glock. <laughs> give him Tom Nook's Glock. But she's at least had some training. What training has the it's rapper like, the rapper it's... had? He's got street smarts, sure. But does street smarts help you when you're fighting a weird, mutated, experimentation a creature? A monster. A monster. Just like Mariam. Yeah. I don't think he'd win against Mario either. <laughs> <laughs> Is there on this list that you think he might win against? Tom Nook. Tom Nook. So he's not the worst. No. But he would get fucking annihilated. Yeah. <laughs> I well, think I think he could convince the goose to give up his ways with a nice rap. I'm not pausing because I'm desperately trying to think of a rap that has the word goose in it. <laughs> Mess with the goose, you get the noose. <laughs> <laughs> if anything, there'd be a duo. <laughs> exactly. Okay, please feel free to share what you think of it if you want to see more. Also, if you wouldn't mind liking and subscribing, that really helps us out. That really helps us commit to making videos about stupid characters fighting. <laughs> Which is really what I want to do for the rest of my life, I think. That'd be incredible. <laughs> I've decided at this moment, this is what I, this is what I want. Just do a tournament. The of... image of Tom Nook hammering a goose to death has really <laughs> driven a... Put, it's put a spark in me. So please do show support. I can't get that image out of my head. <laughs> no it's one <horrible>. can. <laughs> Thank you for watching, guys. And cheers. Bye.